In Unity 2019.3, we've updated both light and dark themes of the editor with new colors and treatments to simplify the UI and increase clarity, helping creators focus more on their content. Not only have we updated the visual style and aesthetics of the interface, but we've also made significant improvements to various features and tools within the editor to make your day-to-day -day life easier and more efficient. Sometimes it can be hard to locate what you're looking for, especially when working on a large project. That's why we've added the new Quick Search feature by pressing Alt plus apostrophe on Windows or Command plus apostrophe on Mac. The Quick Search feature is a powerful tool that enables you to quickly and easily search your project or scenes and also discover settings pages, menu items, and more. Interacting with the search results will reveal the location of an object in your scene or project. You can select an item and open it in your Desktop Explorer or drag items from the result directly into your scene. Quick Search also makes it easier to find associated settings pages and menu items, as well as making it faster to find learning materials or search posts on the Unity forum. The Quick Search tool is flexible and customizable to your needs. By opening the Unity Preferences window, you can change the kind of results you like to see, the priority in which the categories appear, as well as to find the actions performed when you select an item in the list. Another workflow improvement is the Shortcut Manager, which allows you to customize and tailor your editor experience. For instance, if you'd like to change the default shortcut for the Quick Search tool, you can do so by opening the Shortcut Manager by choosing Edit, Shortcuts, and changing the default key shortcut to something more suitable for you. The Shortcut Manager includes all sorts of commands, including some which currently may not have any shortcut key assigned. If there's a tool or command you use frequently, you can assign your own shortcut keys to make it easier to use. In Unity 2019.1, we added presets as a way for you to customize the default state of just about anything in Unity without code. In 2019.3, we've improved the Preset Manager to allow for more than one default per preset type. Now, you can have multiple defaults and can achieve very specific preset behaviors based on naming conventions in your project. For instance, Let's suppose you're importing two sets of images into your project. One of the image sets is intended for material textures, and the other set is intended to be used as icons or images within your user interface. We can define different import settings based on the file name of our textures. Once we've created a preset for the import settings we'd like to use on each texture type, we can locate the preset manager in our project settings and add them as default settings for the importer alongside the filter we'd like to use to classify our images by. The Preset Manager can be a great way to customize default behaviors for different assets and components across our project and make it faster and easier to start working with new assets or components whenever we add them to our project. We've also improved our native editor grid tools to make them easier to use and more customizable. The new Snap Toggle allows you to easily snap objects to grid when using global rotation. You can also choose to toggle different grid views using the button on the scene view as well as adjust the grid opacity in the scene view. For even more customization, you can dock the new grid and snap window and scale the grid size uniformly or adjust it on a per-axis basis. This gives you more precise control over how you can move game objects in the scene. There are now also shortcut buttons to align objects to the grid, making it much easier to keep your game objects level. Another great new feature we've added is scene picking. Scene picking is a new functionality that disables selection of certain parts of a scene to let you interact with what you actually want to. When you're working on a large scene, scene picking helps you work faster and with fewer errors. You can now avoid accidentally moving or selecting objects you're not interested in and stay focused on the ones you are. These are just some of the many improvements we've made to the editor in the 2019.3 release, and we're continuing to look at how we can use your feedback to continue improving your experience using Unity. For more information on additional improvements made in Unity 2019.3, follow the link in the description below. Thanks for watching.